Alright, welcome back for probably another boring episode. That was a good idea. And right now, it's the best lead we've got. In any event... Goodbye. Let's go... Talk with these guys first. If we don't finish that crew... Yes, Shepard? God damn, why do you never have Please, anything to say? You wish to talk more. Noted. You never have anything. So Thessia, huh? I guess the Asari are wishing they had fewer dancers and more command. Too soon? In case you hadn't noticed, we just lost... Reapers rolled in about two weeks ago. So you can assume that I'm generally aware. So why the jokes? Because Edie says that according to your armor's metabolic scans, you're under more stress now than during the skilly. Like, more than Torfan, where you put your whole damn squad through a meat grind. And the last time I had a briefing with Anderson, he told me the guy leading the resistance on Earth is worried about you, and I'm supposed to help. I appreciate the thought, Joe. The hell you are. You're like half robot at this point. No offense, Edie. And it's my fault. When the Collectors blew up the first Normandy, you died because I wouldn't leave. Because you had to come back for me. Couldn't leave the best pilot in the fleet behind. Yeah, well, I guess that would have looked bad on your report. Come on. We got one. Damn. Joker throwing some punches hard right there. Uh, going down, work our way up as per usual. Though I doubt anyone has anything to fucking say like usual. But, let's see what this thing has to say, at least. Ah, fuck it, it's not gonna have anything. I appreciate you checking in on me. Okay. I feel like I've missed multiple things. What can I do for you? Apparently nothing. Sure. Because of my such severely scattered recording for this, I feel like I've missed so much opportunity. For instance, I don't believe I've romanced anyone. I'm not really sure how that happened, but it did. Oh well. Yep. Alright, what's going on here? That's not true! We earned our place in the galaxy! Stop denying reality, Asari. Your people took the knowledge of my people from the Beacon. I have a name. It's Liara Tassoni, and I'd appreciate you using it from now on. No, you're not worth it. There's been enough death today. He'd kick your ass anyway. She's having a bad day. We all are. It will get worse. There is no time to coddle the feelings of a depressed Asari. We recover from this defeat, or we die. Yeah, that about sums it up. It was good to see another of my kind, even if he was just a ghost. One more Prothean fights the Reapers. Okay. If there is to be victory in this war, it will be for all cycles. The living will avenge the dead. And do not concern yourself with Thessia's fate, Commander. The loss of a planet is insignificant next to the loss of the galaxy. Yeah. Yay, I managed to get that one at least. Carry on. And of course you also have nothing. Let's go down here and get a nice surprise. you were. Carry on. And then we just walk off in this direction. I'm sure she did. I'm so embarrassed. <laughs> That's nice. Moving on. Well, at least someone's got a romance. No. I'm trying to word it right. Commander. She got nothing. Moving on. Oh, maybe I can romance her. I don't know. I feel like I've tried to do something. I don't know where, I don't know how. Something's gonna happen or something's not. <clears throat> Find out sooner or later. <sighs> she went straight to her cabin. She's not answering her call. I'll go talk to Liara. 
Yeah, so let's get into this faster. <coughs> Excuse me. Excuse me. And then we talk to Liara. I've studied Protheans my entire life. If I'd been shown the beacon on... You would have needed Shepard's cipher to comprehend it. I still could have learned from it. Instead, my mother hid the galaxy's most important archaeological find from me. It must have been such a joke to her when I became a Prothean researcher. The penalties for withholding Prothean technology are among the harshest in Council space. Your mother's motives may have been simply to shield you. Perhaps. Thank you, Edie. I hadn't considered that. My entire civilization. The Asari. And I abandoned my people. Liara, you had nothing to do with the attack on Thessia. Nothing to do with it? I told those people on Thessia, we... How many Asari died? Because I demanded their help. None. Shepard, that isn't true. Yes, it is. You've been warning your people for four years, Liara. There's not a damn thing you should feel guilty about. If we move fast enough, they'll have a chance to survive this. To start again. So it's only we one planet. Thessia. But we haven't lost the Asari yet. Damn right. It's more than one planet with Asari on it. Helping the refugees. That's something I can... I knew you'd think of something. I still need some time, Shepard. I need some time, Shepard. Okay. A pleasure to see you. Okay. Moving on. And what's through door number two? Garrus, of course. All right, maybe not. Oh, there he is. They made it off Palavin. It was tight. But we'll take every scrap of good news we can get. Wish I had more, though. Why? It's pretty much about his father and sister, I believe. He said our fleets are being decimated, so I advised him to cease all offensive operations against the reef. A full retreat? The only way to save Palavin now is to hold our ships back for the Crucible. But if I'm wrong, then a lot of other Turian families won't be as lucky as mine. If it means anything, I would have given the Primarch the Yeah, there's that ruthless... <sighs> How are you holding up, Shepard? There's only so much fight in a person. Before your friend picks you up, we'll get through this. We always do. Okay, moving on. Yeah, two reputation points for absolutely no reason anymore because my reputation max out. I wish we had a friggin' Geth and Krogan on the team again. I miss those Hopefully guys. She's doing better now. Thanks for talking to her. Neither of us knew what to say. There's not much we can say. But being there helps. Hello? Oh, there you are. I'm sorry, Shepard. You alright? I'm fine. Liara? I don't know. Okay. I'll talk to her. Thanks. This isn't something she should deal with by herself. Same goes for you. Sure. I guess we know what Liara's going through. Yes, I'm dealing with it by running in circles. Err. Uh... That's pretty much everyone, isn't it? Let's go to my cabin and see what armor I have. Maybe there's something I haven't used yet. Or there's someone I haven't talked to yet. I don't know. Oh, well, that's some weird looking headlights. I'd rather have that shield boost. Power. Weapon. Power recharge, recharge. Yeah, no shield regen at all. How sad. I'll stick with those shoulders, I think.
Yeah, let's keep weapon damage. It's a little better. <sighs> Alright, so we'll be going to Sanctuary next time, and then back to the Citadel, and then doing Citadel DLC. Whether we do the actual DLC in a single run, I don't know. It's a big DLC. Commander. So I'll just take us back to the Citadel system. Yes, yeah, back to the Citadel's solar system. <laughs> and that's where I'll stop. <sighs> Alright, well, I hope you enjoyed this recording session in Mass Effect. Not sure how many episodes or how long those episodes will be. Whoops. So, yeah. I gotta record more of this very soon. Hopefully there won't be as big a gap as there was last time. So yeah, until next time I record, later.